Christ's ambassadors who are there. The Christ ambassador is the truest revelation of God upon the earth. The Christ's ambassador is the clearest manifestation and expression of the Godhead upon the earth. In Galatians 2.20, the Bible says, I am crucified with Christ. Nevertheless, I live yet not me, but Christ lives in me. And the life I live in the flesh, I live by faith of the Son of God who loved me and died for me. In John chapter number 17 and verse 18, as the Father has sent me into the world, even so send I you. Now, when the Father sent Jesus Christ, Jesus was anointed by the Father. If we are sent as the Father sent him, if he sent us as the Father sent him, then we can never lack the same anointing the Father gave him. The Father was working in Christ, bringing good to the people and healing all who were oppressed of the devil. Christ said, go, lo, I am with you to the end of time. He is with us as the Father was with him. The Father was working in Christ, confirming the words he spoke with unthinkable miracles, wonders, and signs. And that is what we are here for. The will of God is for us to represent him. And so Christ has chosen us. I am here in the person of Christ. I am here in the place of Christ. I am here in the position of Christ. I am here having his provisions, his power, his anointing and everything. And I'm here for the same purpose which he came. You cannot connect to me and with this platform and remain sick. I don't care. Can you. This is over 30 years of not knowing sickness. I don't care. The kind of sickness you have, you will be healed and be free. Because a faithful ambassador brings healing. The Lord said to me, heal a zillion. Two days later, he came and said, your primary job description is to do good to all and heal all who are oppressed of the devil. I am sent to bring healing from Christ to the sick worldwide. I don't care what you have a sickness. You can't connect to Jesus' mission with us. Christ's ambassador's living mission international and be sick. Unless Christ is sick, then you can be sick. If Christ is not sick, there's no devil under heaven that can make you sick when you are part of when you are a part of this great movement. I don't care the sickness you have. Unless, of course, Jesus Christ did not rise from the dead. Unless God did not raise up Jesus Christ from the dead by his Holy Spirit. If God did, I don't care the sickness you have. You shall be healed and set free. That's why I'm here. Don't watch the devil destroy your life and destiny. Don't watch the devil destroy the life of your loved one. Don't watch the devil destroy those who are members of the church that you are pastoring. What you don't have, you don't have. But what you don't have, God has given to another. Get in touch and be free. Please, don't watch those under you dicey because you are defending what is not working. Don't do it. Get in touch, please. Get in touch. God wants everyone that is sick to be healed. Christ told me, the reason why the sick must be healed is that they are sick. It's not because they are righteous. It's not because they go to church. It's not because they are my children. For as long as they are human beings, the only reason why they are qualified for his healing power, anointing and grace given to me is that they are sick. So if you have any sick person, please get in touch. We have seen the dead come back to life. We have seen people that had heart failure, heart failed, kidneys, organs, liver, everything failed, come back to life, healed completely and perfectly. We have seen all manner of miracles. God has not changed what he did yesterday, he is doing today. What he did yesterday, he will do it forever. So please get in touch. Don't watch your people suffer and die sick. The answer is here. The solution is here. The provision is here. Get in touch and be free. The power is here. The anointing is here. I tell you, I am sent to heal a zillion. I am sent to bring it to the sick. Don't watch your people die sick. Get in touch and be free. God bless you. In Jesus' name. Amen.